In fact, the white cone cloud we see now is not a shadow storm because it is impossible to see the shock wave with the naked eye, and only in the case of light accumulation can the shock wave be seen indirectly. So what do we see? It is actually a steam cone. When an aircraft flies at supersonic speed, the air will expand rapidly in certain areas, such as the edge of the hatch cover or the trailing edge of the wing. This expansion process will cause the local pressure and temperature to drop sharply, and the water vapor in the air will begin to condense at low temperatures, forming a visible white fog. This white fog is actually a steam cone. Its shock wave is just the opposite. Shock waves are compressed airflow. The pressure rises and the temperature rises, and it is impossible to form water mist. The steam cone is the expansion of the air, and the temperature drops, and the water vapor will dissolve. This phenomenon cannot be seen every time. Only when the air humidity is high enough, the temperature conditions and facts will appear. So the steam cones we see are sometimes intermittent, flickering. In addition, there is a similar but different phenomenon of light shock waves, which is when high-speed particles move in water. For example, in some nuclear reactions, the speed of electrons in water exceeds the speed of light propagation in water. 